Yo, Sky. What's up, bro? Hey, bro, I'm working on losing weight. Could I run some of the supplements I'm using by you? Yeah, of course. Okay, cool. Yeah, cool, let's do it. Okay, cool, so um, I bought all these supplements because I want to burn fat. We got some citrulline protein powder, we got collagen, we got some pre-workout, magnesium, uh, I more pre-workout, some creatine, some weird stuff, code SKYFIT, as you know, to save 10%. But yeah, I figure that if I'm gonna lose weight, I'm gonna do it the right way, and so I got these things to help. Yeah, I mean, some of these look great, but uh, I think I saw you word for fast food tonight. Are you making any changes to your diet? Well, I bought the supplements to burn fat. Well, they're supplements, you know, they're not a magic pill. Like, they're not just gonna help if you don't make any changes to your lifestyle. Well, that's what I bought these for. All right, we gotta have a conversation. What's up everybody, Skyler Deem here, founder of Reach Fat Loss and Fitness, where we help you lose weight and build muscle without restrictive dieting, without spending all your time counting calories, and without stepping foot on a treadmill. And today, we are diving into supplementation. Now, I wanna preface this by saying that a supplement is exactly what it sounds like, meaning it is there to supplement your already better, healthier routines and habits. Taking these alone without switching your diet, without switching your movement is going to do pretty much nothing. So if you are not moving your body every day, if you are not eating healthy, Healthy meals and doing the fasting, these are not worth taking. But if you're here and you're doing the fasting, you're doing the healthy eating, you're doing the movement, these are potentially things to add on to your routine. Now, what we're going to go over today has helped clients of mine drop weight and build muscle consistently and sustainably. So if you are looking for more content, we're putting out videos every single week. So make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit that bell to be notified when videos come out. But with that being said, Let's get into it. So the truth was that this video is pretty difficult to make because there are so many reasons of why you may not be burning fat, right? If we look at the individual, there may be reasons having to do with stress. There may be reasons having to do with hormones. There may be reason having to do with metabolism. And so what I did with this video is I looked at a bunch of different supplements and I basically tried to categorize based on different potential circumstances, what you could use in that moment to get better results. And last thing before we get started, if you are struggling to maintain your healthy habits, if you're struggling to maintain the healthy eating, the fasting, the movement, check the link in the description of this video. We got a free training there for you that lays out exactly what we do, as well as the opportunity to book a call in case you want to decide if working together may be a good fit. Supplement number one is for blood sugar maintenance. Now, if you've been in the game, you've probably heard the role insulin plays in fat loss and fat storage. When your body produces lots of insulin to shuttle glucose into the cells, metabolism tends to slow down and you also tend to sometimes have an energy crash and an increased appetite. And so if you struggle with these things, it's a very good idea to make sure that you're regulating your blood sugar, meaning eating the same food but having less of a blood sugar response, which may lead to better results in the future. And so as far as blood sugar regulation goes, my choice would be blood sugar breakthrough by Bioptimizers. The ingredients in this specific supplement are optimized to help regulate your blood sugar. So we've got things here like chromium, B propolis, we got synthox, we got benfotamine, we got banaba extract and gemena sylvestra. And then below we've got a bunch of other things such as cinnamon and melon, which is also there to regulate blood sugar. If you're looking to purchase that supplement, you can go to the link in the description and you might be able to use the code SKYFIT to save some money. But if you're not looking to buy a supplement and you're looking for something that's slightly less effective, but still does get the job done, I would choose to go with a few dashes of cinnamon, about a tablespoon to two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar, and mix that with water and drink it anywhere from 20 to 30 minutes before you eat. But again, if blood sugar regulation isn't your problem, this supplement may not do much for your appetite, your energy, and for regulating insulin. So that brings me to number two, which is uh, probably my favorite fat loss supplement and the most universal Universal, and this is going to be green tea. Now, when you buy green tea, don't just go for the generic Lipton. There are a lot of tea brands out there that use toxic ingredients that mix together a bunch of things that aren't actually green tea. And so make sure you get an organic green tea that's from a high quality source. But green tea is one of the most documented supplements out there for fat loss. It activates something called PPAR alpha, which is there to activate the fat burning gene. So I'm a huge fan of using green tea while you're fasting. You can also do it while you're not fasting, but having it at certain points throughout the day, being careful not to have it too close to bedtime because of the caffeine can be helpful on your fat loss efforts. Supplement number three is going to be L-carnitine. Now L-carnitine is an amino acid that's responsible for helping the body turn fat into energy. One of the studies that stood out to me found that L-carnitine supplementation provides a modest reducing effect on body weight, BMI, and fat mass, especially among adults who are overweight or obese. Supplement number four that I would recommend is getting more omega-3s in your diet. And if you're looking to supplement rather than get it from real food, you can use something like fish oil or krill oil. Omega-3 in these oils are responsible for reducing cortisol, 
which if cortisol is high, you have a higher chance of storing body fat. And of course, because it's the stress hormone, it's also gonna increase the chances of you stress eating and not staying on track. Along with that, fish oil has been shown to help with better recovery from workouts. So of course, if you're less sore, you're gonna be more likely to stay consistent. Before we go any further, I'd love if you could leave me a comment below, just sharing what supplements you're currently using. I create these videos for free. And of course, I love hearing from you in the comments. Supplement number five is going to be as simple as a protein powder. Now, again, this depends on your lifestyle, but what most people find is that when they're working on losing weight, they're not adequately hitting the amount of protein that they need. Higher protein levels have been associated with higher satiety, meaning less hunger throughout the day, while also helping you retain and build more muscle, which is going to increase your natural metabolism, making you burn more calories naturally throughout the day as well. To me, this is a no brainer, especially if you're lifting weights. Having a protein shake is one of the easiest ways to pack more protein into your diet. Personally, I use Sun Warrior protein. Out of all the protein powders I've tried, not only is this one of the tastiest, it's also got the cleanest ingredients and for the price, it's unbeatable. Plus, if you use the code SKYFIT, you can save 10%. And if you throw it on auto ship and buy two tubs, you're going to get an insane price that is pretty much unbeatable anywhere else. And then finally, the sixth supplement that I recommend is magnesium. Now, magnesium helps with over 300 processes in the body that are super important. And unfortunately, over 80% of Americans are deficient in it. Magnesium is responsible for a higher glucose metabolism. It's also responsible for better sleep, which if you're sleeping better, your metabolism is going to improve as well. And it's also better for less stress and a better mood, which is of course going to have a higher chance of keeping you on track. For magnesium sources, you can get this from a lot of good places. I also use Sun Warrior for this brand. Sun Warrior uses a seawater complex that contains some other important minerals besides just magnesium. But out of all the magnesiums I've tried, this is definitely the one that I've liked the most, even though fair warning, the taste isn't the best. But again, if you're ordering their protein powder and you get the magnesium on top, use code SKYFIT, save 10%, put it on auto ship and you're going to save a ton of money. So that's all I got for you today. Again, they're supplements. This is not the answer. This is not the secret that you've been missing. Get your eating in order, get your movement in order, get your sleep, get your stress in order. And then when you feel like you've done what you need to do to the extent that you can, add these supplements and see what benefits they bring. Again, I'm gonna put all the links in the description below so you can just click them and grab them there. If you have any questions, make sure you leave me a comment. Make sure you subscribe to the channel, hit that like and hit that bell. And if you are looking for fat loss help, again, check that link in the description to see how you can book a call so we can decide if it's a good fit. But with that being said, keep going with your weight loss efforts, keep making amazing moves. And of course, as always, make sure to eat smart, move more, sleep deep, and be grateful for this moment. I'll see you in the next video.